Hey everybody, this is Koo Impact with Let's Play Roller Coaster Tycoon! And I built a shuttle loop. That's why I started recording, I built a shuttle loop. Was it good of me to start recording because of this? Actually, the park is doing pretty well. We're not nowhere near 900. And it's approaching year two. Which is concerning, but not that concerning yet. I mean, if I'm at 850 and stuck there, and it's about to be year three halfway. Yeah, then we have a problem. Hopefully we can get 900 before that, because then, you know, that would totally work out in the end. There's nothing they can do to stop the coup. Also, the speculations of that, that, that this place being on Mars. I, I could believe it being Roller Coaster Tycoon. Although, terraforming Mars is supposed to take lots and lots of years. They say they want to bring one tree over at a time. It's a pain in the ass. It's a process, but hey, this might be after they terraformed it. How many years in the future do you think it has been? Okay, i seen the numbers go up. Yet, I don't see the numbers anymore. There it is. Oh, this is going to be complicated. Build it anyways. I might be able to make the entrance pretty spectacular. I've got a cat scratching at my door. No, no. I'm not letting you in. I'm recording. Jeez. So those, those of you who do know or don't know about this, but, uh, Ku got, Ku has now a roommate, or will have a roommate soon. He, he has not arrived yet. He's a foreigner. That's not bad either. I, I, I applaud that. He, he is a foreign exchange student coming to the college, and I must share a room with him. And all that jazz. And I, I talked with him, yes. I've talked with him before. I talked with him uh, through emails so far. He, he seems like a great guy. He's totally for the... He, he respects Ku's what we call a hobby or career on YouTube. He respects that Ku does this, and he's all down with that. As long as we don't interrupt his studying, like if he's reading a piece of literature, or if he's doing something for school... Ku's not allowed to really record then, so... Ku's trying to think up a schedule that would work for this. You know, you know what Ku means. This is all just, you know, ahead time scheduling, because it seems to be a lot of you watch this series, so it's good to tell you guys this kind of stuff now. It also entertainingly lightens things up when I'm not building stuff. But there was some good go-karts right there. Go-karts galore! The bumper boats! are clustered. I don't know why they're clustering like that. Be one with the cluster. Be not one without the cluster. So yeah, there's going to be a lot of changes in scheduling, the way things are done. Pretty much everything. Videos are going to become... Uh, I don't know. I'll try to do one or two a week. Maybe more if I have a chance. Who's got intense classes ahead of him? You know how college is. Some of you do. I know for a fact that some of you are going to college, either if it's your first year or not or anything. You know how college is. It kicks you in the it kicks you in the nards pretty hard, and I I can't I cannot do under a certain amount this semester, or I get kicked out. So they made that pretty clear in the red printed letter. We don't want Ku to become a college dropout now, do we? No, none of us want that. And then for those people who do want that, you probably were people who liked Passage of the Hollow Moon for its graphics. And all I can say from that is graphics whores. I don't know many people like that, but I, I heard they exist. No persecution on any viewer out there right now. I mean, it was the same reason when Passage of the Hollow Moon came out that I played it for a few, I don't know, minutes, probably only an hour, an hour and a half, before I realized that the game was not really that impressive. It wasn't like Star X at all. That's what I'm saying. When games are not like Star X, where poison is your biggest threat, then what kind of game are you really playing? 
The status ailment should be a very big bane on the player. It's got to be inconvenient. At least. I'll tell you, I might not have made poison inconvenient for Myth's Rebirth, but there are status ailments in Myth Rebirth that are going to become a big pain in the ass on your stuff. Like, you're gonna be cursing your brains out. Like, why the fuck did the creator of this, Ku Impact, do this to us? How dare he? How dare he make us suffer? And now I have to go all the way back to the inn, or the hospital in particular, to cure myself from this. Because, you know, cure all costs just way too much mana. The thing that can heal everything is gonna cost a lot of mana. Unless, unless, of course, you have, you, unless you have, uh... Yori on your party. If you have a Yori on your party, then damn. You can pretty much get rid of anything, son. Ain't that right, little mower man? Look at them go. You know, since I have one mowing, I might as well replace him with one that's not mowing. Like, pathwise. Hopefully this guy doesn't drown. Why do I not... Oh, why am I so understaffed? It's almost year two. Gosh darn it. God dang it, Bobby. Why do I have none of these? They're purple in this park. Everything's purple in this park. How's that aquatic theme? Wow, he really did cut up all these patches of grass. Yet there's still crabgrass everywhere. Splash Storm! It's like Hydro Storm. I don't know what I, I don't know what direction I should go in next. Who's waiting for new rides to be researched, uh, things to be done? We actually don't have a lot of uh, gentle rides in this park, which amazes me. Why do we not? Maybe I should uh, start setting that to ten minutes. A lot of rides are breaking down recently, which is not good. Not good at all. Games freezing up. That's not good either. Fangs on the swinging ship. It's a ship that swings. What do you not get about it? There are two of them in the park. He's on not this one, though. Log Flume 2 and 1 break down the most. I'm just making sure all these are correct. Wow, that's very broken. I want, I want it every... I want it every 10 minutes. Nothing like that happening. Luckily, log flumes, from my knowledge, can't blow up when the cars collide into each other. That'd be just too unrealistic, wouldn't it? Unless someone wants to make a video response of a log flume blowing up, because then you totally proved Koo wrong. I want to see it happen. You can't just tell me in the comments or something like that. That the proof, man. Need proof. If I hadn't mentioned this in a, another video being uploaded today, it's uploaded Palooza today. So be sure to check out all the videos that are being uploaded in the uploaded Palo the uploaded Palooza. Don't want to miss out on any of the progressing action because these are done to get progress done. That's why you see me here sitting playing Roller Coaster Tycoon. Oh well, actually, I was playing that already. You know, it's just I didn't I didn't actually plan to record this. But uh, I built that looping coaster, and I thought, hey, achievement unlocked. You feel me, bro? You feel me, bro? You feel me, sis? Because now we have, uh... We actually have a female LP here in the Coos crew, which is awesome. You should go check her out. She's doing Banjo-Kazooie. That's a great game, by the way. I don't know if she's 100%ing it or not. You have to ask her. Listen to her LP watcher, you know, her name's Husky. Husky in numbers. You know, everyone... I don't... I can't help but the numbers being such a hard thing to memorize. Also, those people in the battle boats are seeming to have a lot of trouble with them. They, they really can't find the exit, can they? But yeah, I've plugged her already and I'm plugging her again because, you know, hey, when, how often do you see a female LP here? I mean, even in today's standards, when there are a percent more of them, but how often do you see them do it, like, with such eccentric 
uniqueness. Not just going off, hey, I'm a girl, so watch my stuff. She's actually doing it like a player. She has the fundamentals of, a, of an LP -er. LP fundamentals are important. Ku tries to follow them very religiously. Just to make sure he doesn't become what he doesn't want to become. Dun 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 No, we're not playing Metal Gear though. Roller Gear Solid, yeah. I should make an all metal coaster. I should do it! I should make it massive, I should use cheat codes to lock my money in place, and I should do it not in this park, but like when I get to the last park. That would be great. Build the most insane roller coaster ever and then just have it like that and the madness of its twisting turns and flying loops and corkscrews and follies everywhere. It may break the speed limit to be like faster than the speed of light. Fang's gonna go fend off some bats now. He has an umbrella. Umbrella Ella Ella A A A. Sitting here under my umbrella. L L L A A A A A. Too many A's that time, damn it. Ugh. Oh, this curse, it's going to get to me. Eventually. Yes, it's the umbrella curse. Just like that corporation that made a bunch of zombies from viruses, but they're not really zombies. They're kind of more mutants than anything because it's just flesh eaten and not eaten flesh. Do, do you understand the conspiracy of all that? There's a big difference. Why is Splashstorm so much money? It is a water... It is a river rapids. It's not even that impressive as a river, uh, river rapids. I could actually do better. And that's saying something, because water rides are not Coos Forte. Although, the cave did really well. Did really well. We actually did three water theme parks in a row. That's pretty crazy. We gotta do a different themed park next time. I'll make sure of it. We'll do something else. If anything, I guess I have to go back and do Evergreen Gardens. But that's that's all up to you guys. Because I'm gonna let you vote for the next park when we're done this one. So when you see the little vote thing, you vote for the available parks and you know what to do. You've done it before. To anyone who's a new subscriber and a viewer who hasn't done it before, go do it. It's well worth putting your voice into the comments and, uh... Ku reads them all, of course, and then show show off that, hey... We voted for this park and you're gonna suffer for it, Ku. You're gonna pick a hard one or something. Lightning Peak's gonna be a pain in the ass, unfortunately. I always have trouble with it later on. Hopefully, things will go better. Same with Ivory Towers. Oh, boy. I can always do... But I can do Thunder Rock really good. Like, I do decent at Thunder Rock. I don't understand why. That's supposed to be the hardest park in the first game. Ugh. My head spins sometimes. When Ku does things, it doesn't make any logical sense whatsoever. This is why logic is one of the biggest enemies of Ku. Because it just doesn't work. In the meantime, I am almost out of time, so this has been Ku Impact with Let's Play Roller Coaster Tycoon. Do not forget to subscribe, rate, comment. As a bonus, you might leave your reaction because those are new and they're pretty hilarious sometimes. Other than that, I wish you and bid you good day. And this will be. A conclusion that no one seen coming. That would be... A... B... C... Good night.